Apparently, soon we will have the newly updated COVID booster shots designed specifically to target Omicron's BA.5 subvariant. This is the variant that is now the predominant Omicron variant that has affected majority of the population worldwide. The question is, do we need it? And if so, who's going to be eligible to get them? That's what this. So the newly updated COVID vaccine will provide the best level of protection against the highly transmissible BA.5 subvariant to date. This new updated vaccine will be against the new subvariant that has been hitting our country and worldwide, especially soon in the fall and winter when a large wave of COVID infections is projected to hit the United States. The question, however, is do we need it? And if so, whether we need to wait for this new updated booster or get the available booster now in our country. Now, once the updated Omicron variant vaccine is available, the question also is who will be eligible? Now, it is said that anyone ages 12 and up who has completed a primary vaccination series can be eligible to get this updated vaccine. In fact, it is unlikely to matter whether you've received any other booster doses or not before. However, what we know is that if you're unvaccinated, you definitely will not be eligible for the updated formula until you have completed the primary series with the existing available COVID vaccines. The longer answer to the question is that who is eligible somewhat depends on which booster shots actually get approved and when. What I'm saying is that if the first vaccine updated will be uh, that will be approved is the Pfizer bivalent shot, which targets both the COVID strain original and the Omicron BA.5 subvariant, this is expected to be authorized first and therefore can be given to all vaccinated individuals ages 12 on up. But on the other hand, if it's the Moderna bivalent vaccine shot that is expected to follow in October, we'll have somewhat narrower range of eligibility, at least at first vaccinated people ages 18 or older. Now in our country, if and when we get this updated vaccine, then definitely the shots could first be available to those most at risk, such as the elderly and the immunocompromised. Now, at present, we continue to advise everyone to get vaccinated and boosted. Now, noting that the country's approved vaccine continues to work exceptionally well at preventing severe illness, hospitalization and death even with the Omicron subvariant BA.5. So if you haven't received the booster shots yet, please be advised that I strongly recommend you get one the soonest. There's really no reason for us to wait for the updated Omicron booster shot. Instead, go get the booster shot now offered by the government to all individuals. At any rate, the people who will get boosted now will still be able to get the BA.5 booster dose in a few months when their immunity from the booster wanes. What's important is that we are learning more about the virus. We are getting smarter against the virus and the vaccines continue to help us get back a sense of normalcy. Again, this is Dr. Jerry Tan. See you again soon.